morning, everybody. Welcome to the Daily Digest with Jimmy Disu. And of course, today being Wednesday, today is today is their Bumi Day. Not just that, today is also Amala Day. Not just that, today is also the birthday of my childhood friend, General J.B. Samuel, retired general. He's 70 today. All my friends are getting the crossing the 70. Cut here today, mommy, Danny. I want to get to that floor very quickly. <laughs> so we, yes, yes. Uh, there are, well, um, there are JB Samuel, you know, happy birthday. We we called him Bab Dad in school, and I think from when we were in Form One, we had a funny feeling that I used to think that he would become a policeman because he had this look. You know, he was very, quiet, he's very quiet. Was very quiet in school and had this very stern look. So I wasn't surprised when I heard that um, he had joined the army and he did very well. To, to become a major general in his service, not easy. It's not easy. I think I think they say that after you can progress, I think, up to the point of Cornell, you know, by normal ranking and so on. So after that, you have to work extra. Anyway, happy birthday, Babdas. I don't know where the the party, whether there's a party or not. But I'll find out if I can have my lunch there. Why not? I also have here, yeah, yeah, no, I don't know which one, I don't know which, which one to call you. Uncle Jimmy, mm-hmm. my name is Oluwa Yemisi Adekunle. Okay, 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 okay. The last time you were here, what did we call you? What you choose to call me might not be what. <laughs> yeah. Okay, we will we, we, we will just call you Yemisi for now because even the article might change anytime from now. It's too long. The form that we use here. <laughs> anyway, yeah, it's nice to see you. Thank you. Uh, and and I, I have an intern here. He, he, you know, he's a student from Wazobe Academy. What's his name? James. 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 Jerry. Jerry Rollins. And I have he, Jerry here. And he, 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 he looks like Rollins, though. He looks like <laughs> Rollins, yes. Okay, okay. I've just introduced you. You can go back to your seat. Sorry. Okay. You can go back to your seat. Just so that people know that you are here. All right. Let's get down to business very quickly. Good morning, Auntie Bumi. Uh, today is uh, for the Amala people. They know themselves. Today is uh, Amala. You go with me one day. Can I come as well? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, Why? So, so Your coffee, you can come. So, so Uncle Jimmy, Auntie Bumi is our auntie. Uh, ah, I can't take coffee. Uh, <laughs> uh, 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 you just said it for the whole world to hear. Ah, 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 I'll, I'll go with you. Kofi can Kofi. come and scatter ground for you. Uh, I don't but understand. But I will not, <laughs> Uncle Jimmy. No, I don't you, understand. You, you get in the way, but I want to. Lawyer, Missy, I don't understand. Kofi, though. we know you. Ah, we we know, know what we know. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm a saint, sir. Oh, yeah. Uh, We've not uh, even gone uh, that, uh, that uh, level. Just, just, just Amala. Yeah, <laughs> only okay, okay, okay. Only, okay. I'll eat only Amala. Kofi is okay. It's okay. It's all right. It's all right. Okay, let's get down to business. Um, yeah, let's look at what we have to look at today. Okay. Wife and mistress are currently pregnant. Double barrel in here. This is what we call a one-one go let's draw. Uh, this one is constant moms are wearing me down. Um, she earns more, but I pay all the time. Ah, Ari. Jumai says that he once dated my mom. That's her current boyfriend. Don't you my marriage? Don't you former? As it was in the time of the mom, so shall it be in the time of the daughter. Wow. And another one is, I doubt if he fancies me, Rolly. And Inkiru, <laughs> Inkiru was here yesterday. Hope he's not our farmer. Hey, not, not our farmer. <laughs> Says, should I wait or make the first move? Let's try, let's start with wife and mistress currently pregnant. H- help me keep this somewhere, please. I, think it's I know that's what will interest on Pujimi. I just ah. knew it. Why would I be interested in... Wife and mistress pregnant. Kofi, do we know I why Uncle Jimmy will be interested in I ignore in that. that. I ignore that. I ignore <laughs> that. I ignore that. I take no offense. After a series of my wife's miscarriages, I thought of trying for a child with one of my girlfriends. But for my philandering, my marriage would have been happier. My wife had cut me out. Who's, whose phone is on? Let me see your phone. Let's just have it, please. Just bring it. Let's get it out of here. Mm. So sorry about that. We had uh, some interference. So my wife had caught me out a few times, but I've always promised to change. 
When my current girlfriend told me she was pregnant, I was shocked because my wife was pregnant again. And we were hoping she carry it to full time. Ah, why, why were you hoping to carry it to full time? She said the wife had that series of Serious, okay, so they were praying. When I told my girlfriend my wife was pregnant, she was furious. <laughs> what did you think the guy was doing at home at night? She was furious. Now, do you, do you, she reminded me I told her my marriage was more or less over and encouraged her to have a child for me. I see. So there was a breach of contract. Mm. He says, when I got home a few days later, my wife was in tears. She'd had another miscarriage and was inconsolable. It gave way to tears too. And when I eventually told my girlfriend, she said we should both take a chance at being parents since I didn't love my wife. That the, that the miscarriage was convenient. I thought the girlfriend was pregnant. Now I feel I have to support my current girlfriend. But how do I leave my wife when she's so unhappy? This man is a confused man. He's not a confused man. He's a man that wants to hit his cake and have it. He's a very selfish man. Not considerate of his wife's feeling. Because if he was, like he mentioned in the narrative, he said that if he had been faithful to his wife, but for his philandry, mm. his marriage would have been happier. So he's been sowing oats all over town. Mm. And we, ah, we will show that the girlfriend's pregnancy belongs to him. Ah, yeah, Mr. Madan Kolev. Yes. He might be listening. Yeah, hey, let him listen and hear the truth. Madan Kolev, no, 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 withdraw that statement. No, 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 Uncle Jimmy. The man might no, the uh, man man even be incapable <laughs> of impregnating a woman. Let's just face it. No, but he, he impregnated his wife. He, he came down. Uncle Jimmy, have you gone to check the DNA records in Lagos State recently? No. Okay, so maybe that will give you... That should do a DNA on board. myself to women find out... Women even go... The essence women go to to keep their marriages. And for a woman that has been having a series of miscarriages and is desperately trying to save her marriage because she's, the man himself confessed that he's been philandering. So a I, man I, I, about I, town, sewing everywhere, anything, any whole portable. This is daytime. Oh, uh, okay. Yes. Wow. So, w w what what should he do now? I think this is a, this is he, his mind is not clear. Jokes apart and inventos okay. apart, he doesn't have a clear mind as to what he wants. For example, who do you himself. think he likes the more, the girlfriend or the wife? Maybe that you should choose it. one. You should choose whom he likes and stick with the person that he likes. Yes. You should let the poor woman go if he doesn't want to stay in that marriage anymore. There's no point keeping the man. And you know, this is also for the woman as well. You don't need to stay in a loveless marriage. Once the marriage is over, you, it's better for you to take a walk when your dignity is still intact mm. than for you to walk, uh, to keep trying to walk a marriage that is obviously dead. But this, the, it doesn't say here that the wife knows about the girlfriend, though. Said boy for his philandering. That man, that means. And she caught him once. Uh -huh. So she has caught him. When if, you catch a, a, if you catch a man philandering, mm -hmm. what, what are the implications? The implication is that you ask yourself that do I want to stay in this marriage? Or do I want to take a walk? Is it if you catch him once or in multiple times? <clears throat> Uncle Jimmy, I think the choice is for every woman to make. If you catch him once, you should ask yourself that. Is it worth it? Will he do it again? What are the circumstances that led to him going this way? Mm. Anyway. 0700-993-993. Because this one calls for... For public, uh, 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 public, public discourse. <laughs> public discourse. <laughs> zero seven hundred nine nine three nine nine three nine nine three, and zero two zero one four six five seven one nine zero, so that we can actually tell Desmond what to do with himself. I would think that he might need to see a shrink. Well, he doesn't from, need a shrink. From, he should no, be no, a wait. shrink to himself. Okay. <laughs> no wait. From from the letter, you can see a, a few infantile reasoning in between the kind of reasoning you probably see at uh, nursery two or so uh, so i think he might need to see if he might not be a full shilling like when he was to talk he would say he might not be he looks unstable yeah it's very very unstable mm, yeah looks unstable. very very mm. because moving from one girl to another woman to another impregnate this one impregnate that one then you're not like uh, my wife is not happy. My girlfriend is unhappy. What's your business with your girlfriend? Do you want to see? You know, you with know, them? you know. If if we were to go the traditional way, mm -hmm. like most of us would think when we are back in the village, some people will be saying that 
the 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 miscarriage that the wife had was because he told the girlfriend. Yeah, some people will reason that way. Would you? Um, would you? Would why you? should I reason that way? I'm not no. asking why. I said, would you? It's no, yes, I wouldn't. It's a yes or no. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. It's a yes or no situation. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. It's a yes or no I wouldn't. situation. No, Uncle mm-hmm. Jimmy. Mm. He once dated my mom. This is Drew Mai. Hmm? Mm-hmm. It certainly is a small world. My current boyfriend is over 20 years older, but I love him a lot. Wow. Mm, is it is it is that a bad is that a 20 years gap between you and a man hmm. I, is it allowable okay so i remember when i was in uni and i had a friend that later got married to this very very older man mm. he was about 20 something years older than our age group mm. he's about 20 something years older than our age group so one day and i am very close to my dad so one day this guy came to drop us off in, in, at my parents so my dad now has ah, who i said ah, that's so 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 person's boyfriend i didn't even think twice about it you know my dad didn't say anything but i could see something i could read everything it was a bit way. worried yes so later i now went to me i said i saw the way you look the other time I said, how did you i said i saw it that so what is it i said let yeah, me say i would advise you once the age gap is more than 10 years you have extra work to do to keep the marriage if it eventually leads to marriage and i have held on to that in my adult, so years. adult years yes because yeah. you find out that there's a shift that that over 10 years brings into the dynamics of the relationship and you just keep to you need to keep doing some stuff to what reassure kind of stuff? uncle jimmy you said this is daytime so oh, okay <laughs> so okay, you know okay, okay, okay. you we have to keep so you're living the rest of our imagination uh, you can say that some w- some women will ag- argue with you that sometimes the more mature the man the better the relationship. Uncle Jimmy, age has nothing to do with maturity. You've seen 70 year olds that behave like 20 something year old. And we've seen 20 something year olds that act way more wiser than mm-hmm. their age. So mm-hmm. it has nothing to do with the age, really. It's more about the kind of guy that the man is. Man is. And, you know, the way he reasons, does he respect you? Mm. Does he see you as a partner? Does he see you as somebody that he can build a very beautiful life with? Okay, Jimmy, why are you looking at me like that? How am I looking at you? <laughs> you're not supposed to. You're supposed to be looking at your microphone. <laughs> I have to look at you because we are having a conversation here. Yeah, and I'm listening to you. Uh, uh, romance will really. <laughs> oh, okay, Jimmy, why, why are you blushing? <laughs> Uncle Jimmy is looking at you me. Walk, you, you walk, you you walk, you walk right back into it. <laughs> Why are you blushing, okay, Uncle so Jimmy? Okay, so I'm listening. So I'm listening. So I'm listening. I, I could see it written all over you. Uh, <laughs> let us just say that freedom is good. Yeah, it is, Uncle Jimmy. Mm. You can say that again. Between the two of us, we understand. Yeah, we do, we do, Freedom we do. I had good. a party to celebrate it, really. You should. It's really Congratulations. Good. Yeah, thank you so much. Oh, okay, so we are going to open up our line 0700 0201-465-7190. Chris, don't call. You called yesterday. Okay, he's the only one who is banned for now because I know <laughs> this is the kind of topic he wants to. But he called yesterday. So, Chris... <laughs> Don't call. Put the call through to Ghana and keep yourself <laughs> busy. Of course, I, I'll expect a lot of contributions, <clears throat> especially from the women. Uh, we'll expect some contributions from the women. Okay, so whilst we're waiting for that to to happen... Sorry. Yes, while we're waiting for that to happen, we'll read the, the rest of the story. When he mentioned the neighborhood where he grew up, I told him my mother came from the same area. Hmm. You see, it's getting complicated. He asked what her maiden name was and he was visibly embarrassed when I told him. He admitted that it had a relationship with my mom whilst they were growing up. And of course, all kinds of things happened. This has really shaken me badly. I don't know if I can keep on seeing him with the possibility of both him and my mom meeting again after all these years. What if we eventually get married? It will certainly be weird uh, being with a man who's been with my mom in the past. 
I think I think she should I think she should run away. Yeah, I think she should just. It, 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 it's going to be a bit she untidy. Should, she, yeah, she should leave that drama. Save herself that drama. It's very, very untidy because very untidy. someone yeah. that has been with your mom and now you are married to that. But person. what is the? What I'm asking, you know, just because I'm the anchor of the show, otherwise I wouldn't ask. What would happen if, if even if she marries him? Okafor's law could happen. Yes, for those who know Okafor's law, fine. If you don't know Okafor's law, ask your neighbor. <laughs> <laughs> if you get it, you get it. You get it. If you don't get it, you don't get <laughs> Forget it. Forget about it. Yes. Okay. So, uh, so yes. Okay, uh, but but, but apart, uh, even if that doesn't happen, let's assume that you know it's just a bit uncomfortable. It's very very uncomfortable, Jimmy. But and why is know? it? Why is it that once a man and a woman have been together at any point in their lives, nothing stays the same again? Even the years will not kill it. Ah, uh, I think God put that desire there for a purpose. You think so? Yeah, I believe God the put it there it, for a the purpose. The moment it happens, yes, now, Uncle Jimmy, it can and you never know, be the, same the only books always support that this desire should only be consummated in a marital situation. So I think it still takes us back to abstinence. Hold your body, no How? matter the hold your, your body in the paper bag. Put, put your body inside where it's meant to be. <laughs> And don't give it to someone that is not meant oh, to be okay, with I think you. We have, a we, have a, we have a call. I think we have a call. Hello, good morning. Okay, we lost. We lost the call. Because somebody said, hold. But when I hear things like, hold your body. Hold your body, Uncle Jimmy. We are, we are on daytime radio. No, I just don't, said yes, Okay, yes. so don't sleep around. I understand all that. I you mean, can be, you can, maybe, okay, let's assume the mom and that guy dated without... Sleeping been, together, been yes. There might not be anything. Oh, I dated your mom, but nothing. I'm dating you now. Nothing but, has but happened. If, if she can easily walk away. She's considering marriage because she's thinking of oh, I slept with him. I can, will I leave him? Where do I start from? What will happen and all that. Mm -hmm. So you know, hold your body. So what? What we recommend? What I think what we should recommend here, yeah, Missy, with the agreement of Feta here. I Feta with the of Feta. I know Feta's man, and she will agree. You should have a f uh, you should have a form like they have in the pilots, in, in, like pilots have in the plane. Ending level check, ending level check, check. You should have a checklist. Of course. I, 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 and and part of it, for future purposes, is this kind of thing that can happen. Yes. So do you know my mom? Mm -hmm. Yes. And you well, know, I see a lot of people go into relationships without doing the check, and that check mm. is really important before you get into. So we now add mom to the checklist, just in case. Who, where did you grow up? Oh, I grew up in so so place. You know, the conversation got to where did you grow up? Oh, I grew up in so so neighborhood. Oh, my mom grew up there as well. If they had done the checklist from the get go, it wouldn't get up to this level. She would have been able to decide that, oh, no, I can't. What does our culture say about being intimacy with, with a mother and a daughter? Okay. All beat by accident. You know, there's a what Yoruba, there's a Yoruba belief that, um, when you sleep with a mother and a daughter, mm. you have been able to fortify yourself against death. Oh, Niku? Oh, Oti Shogun, I couldn't hear. That's a joke, that's a joke, that's a joke. Oti Shogun, I couldn't hear. So, are you kidding? I didn't yes, know Uncle Jimmy. So, you have become Kokumo? Uh huh. So, you know. It's really, no, really. No, but I don't think so. I, 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 I it happens. Maybe though, you should yeah. ask the older people that knows about culture. How many, how many people are older than I am yeah. now? And that's what I said. That knows about culture. You don't know because you are, you are not really a Nigerian per se. Well, okay. So we, what do we tell Juma now? I think she should run for cover. She should run for cover. And you know, when going into another relationship, she should do the checks from the but very how many beginning. people with her mom have known her back. No, but just to just to be sure. Just Hello. to be sure. Hello, good morning. Uncle Jimmy, good morning. Yes. Mm, that was she just said just now. I know about it. So, ah. Well Living one. with a daughter and a, a, a mother. Yes. So that is what the person was saying. That is why he's doing it. He did not say that so. That cover him for all those things. But now, if you look at his life, the life is miserable. It's not it to say part because of all those things he were doing. Mm. Then let the man run away from all those things. 
Thank you. No, it's not. It's not to be done on purpose. Um, uh, we, remember, remember though that uh, Jebum is a whole lot of fun. So don't take everything to heart. It's, we're just having fun here. It's not something that should be. I don't want everybody thinking that because I want to live long. We don't want all mothers-in-law running for cover. <laughs> and I think I can take just one more call before I go, or else I'll be I'll be reading the. Even if I start reading it now, I'll have to. Can I go on break now? I don't want to be caught out by this engine. Yes. Okay. So let's let's we'll take a short break and I'll be right back. Can actually take this call? You have a call? Yes. Oh yeah, let's take it. Very quickly. If it talks. Hello, quickly, you have a minute. Hello, good morning, Uncle Jimmy. Quickly, you have a minute. You have That's a minute. Okay, who's on on the line? This is hmm. Uncle Jimmy, in evil race. Eh? Uh, is very very unsightly for a man hmm. to play along with the mother and play along with the daughter. Yes. Mm -hmm. It's an omen in Nepal race. Okay. Thank you, sir. All right. We'll take a short break and we'll be right back. That dial daily digest returns in a moment. We report, you decide. Topical conversations that matter to you. There are people for personal, religious, whatever reasons who do not want to take a vaccine, mm -hmm. and I think they have the rights. They cannot go to not to stop. Trader, are you ready for the flight? Yeah, maximize your gains day or night. The platform HFM is the name. Trading with us is a brand new game. Come on. Feel Execution slow, switch to HFM, watch your success grow. Higher leverage, tighter spreads and swap free. Got your back in this financial fight. Trade forex, commodities, eh? indices, shares and more. Just come and see. HFM online trading. We draw us, they proceed gone in a dash. Our execution too fast. HFM stands apart from the rest. HFM stands apart from the rest. HFM finito. HFM is ito. HFM National Platform, online trading, forex trading, any trading, HFM no delay. Join HFM today. Visit www.hfm.com or download the HFM app on Google Play or App Store. HFM, online trading at its finest. Attention, Airtel customers. If your line has been blocked, then this is for you. Head to the nearest Airtel shop with your NIN. Our friendly staff will help you get your line back up and running. Don't let a blocked line keep you out of touch. Airtel, a reason to imagine. In Nigeria, the weather can change in an instant. Just like life itself. Even when you are caught in a heavy downpour or hammer tan has left your skin dry, there's one thing that never changes. The restoring power of Vaseline Petroleum Jelly. Because we all know, when Hamilton strikes, if you are not protecting your skin, it cracks. So do your lips and no one wants that. So, use Vaseline Petroleum Jelly to keep your skin healthy, smooth, moisturized and protected all day long. So you can embrace every season with confidence. So why do you have so many teas and sachets of cowbell? Oh, it's what I plan to share this Ramadan. <laughs> My sister, you can start by sharing some with me now. Oh yeah, take. It's Ramadan after all. In this holy month, share the nourishing goodness of cowbell with friends and family. It contains vitamin B9, Vitarich, and it's so creamy, so good. Ramadan Kareem. Cowbell of creamy goodness. Okay, investment food. Service for you, fit trust. Oh, it's time to live the good life. Oh, secure the bag with I invest. I invest oh, with I invest. Secure the bag. I invest oh, with I invest. Hey, secure the bag. I invest oh, with I invest. Secure the bag. With I invest oh, the bag. I invest oh, the bag. Yes, I invest 
is one way to build lasting wealth. Buy Nigerian equities. Get higher interest rates on fixed deposits and savings. Visit www.i-investng.com to access a wide range of other financial products that offer good returns on your investments. All transactions are done through regulated financial institutions. I invest. Let's help you secure the bag. Just yeah. All right, no fam. My name is brother Shaggy, aka Mr. Rob. And I can tell you, say Rob, they deliver fast and long lasting relief for muscle aches, joint pains, and symptoms of cold and kata rubbing pain out. That's your day, and have a good time. He won't you need to have the break time. He won't cream out. It's not see, but for Garita. He won't cream out. Cream out. He won't cream Ah, the drama, the suspense, the emotions, the gang gang moments. Don't miss out on Nollywood movies and web series on YouTube with the YouTube Buffet Plan from MTN. You can enjoy over 10 hours of Nollywood content made for you. Sharply dial star 312 star 800 hash to activate the YouTube Buffet Plan from MTN and start enjoying. YouTube made for you. Ah, my brother, I'm not fit to find my shares. Oh, it be like say all the money where I put for shares done lost. So. <laughs> that one that's more matter now. You never hear of ISF? ISF now the integrated shares finder. Where integrated trust and investment in carry come. Now in video bonga product we go help you find your missing shares and dividends. With the any money, you could just register for ISF, and ISF will go get your shares and dividends the back sharp sharp. You find your shares just to call zero nine zero one five zero two five nine. 92 or 0703 041 6997 or check our website for www.integratedtrustng.com. I be make you come our head office for Integrated Trust Office 61 Marina Lagos or Office for Ibado and Abuja ISF. Now the show way to find your missing shares and dividends. 99.3 Nigeria Info. Your number one station for talk. Let's talk. Let's talk. Welcome back. Welcome back. This is Daily Digest with Jimmy Disney. You welcome to the Daily Digest with Jimmy Disney. Today is Wednesday and it's Dear Bumi Day. And um, in Dear Bumi circles, today is Amala Day. So we are talk. going there together today. You and who? You and I. I'm not going, I'm not going anywhere with you. Everybody, everybody go be in Papa name. Auntie Bumi, I'm inviting myself. You do you know her house? Yes. Where? I, 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 have you forgotten that day that we went to her house together? That you, you and who? You and I. Now I was in the car you and you went inside. Ah. Uncle Jimmy, don't let me Auntie Bumi, you. Did I, me. I didn't come in now. <laughs> Mm -hmm. All right, so this is a common problem. It's a very common problem, and a lot of people will identify with this. She earns more. Mm. That's problem number one. Mm. But problem number two is that I pay all the time. Mm. So let's say that she's working in the bank, she's a bank manager, but I'm a clerk in the ministry, but I pick up all the bills. Mm. He says that my girlfriend holds a manager, you see, managerial position in a fairly big company, and she earns more than I do. But she never puts her hand in her pocket to pay for anything we share together, either meals or drinks. She goes on and on about equal rights for women, but expects me to pay for everything. Now, that's a bad habit, but I'm get, I'll get to it. Most of the time, she doesn't even say thank you. How can I get her to stop being such a freeloader? You are dating a, self, a, a, a very entitled woman, and I think that's the problem on its own. Uh, but it's, it's, it's a bit of a general problem where... This part of the side of the woods, people believe that it's a man that must always pick up the bill. I think there's. I don't think it's general, Uncle Jimmy. It's Maybe the segment of women that you. No, 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 no. It's general. I don't think the so, exceptions Uncle to Jimmy. the rule. It is general. It I is see. Not. I meet the woman. You don't. It is general. Mm, maybe it's a wo the kind of woman you it's are dating. It's not the kind. The kind, the kind. The kind of woman are people like you. Ah, no, no. I'm, <laughs> not, I'm not the type of woman that you need to talk to me. Emma, no, 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 no. But, 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 but I, need, I need to tell women that it is self-respecting. For you for, to pick your bills? You pick, no matter how rich you think yeah. the guy is, 
once in a while, just say, hey, hold on, hold on. It's my turn this time. Mm -hmm. I think it's very, very crucial. Yeah, most it of, is. Most of them don't, don't, yeah, they don't, they don't do that. And um, so let's hear what, uh, what people have to say. Do we have any comments on uh, WhatsApp YouTube or guys. YouTube? Yes. Some interesting ones on YouTube from mm -hmm. Blair Aya who says, one of my girlfriends, my current girlfriend, now wow, all these mistresses who still believe men that claim that they will leave their wives are serious. The man mm. should carry his cross. And then he says 20 years um, age difference is two different generations. That's too much of an age gap. Yes, will he regard you as someone he can respect? Mm -hmm. Will you be calling him sir or give him a pet name? You give him a pet name, <laughs> call him babe. Mm. Oh, Uncle Jamie talking from experience. Really? Yes. Yes. Babes. Okay. Babes. Babes. I agree. I agree. I agree. <laughs> You call him honey. You call him babe. Okay, I, I think sir. that I think that to each his own. Mm -hmm. I have people who have sworn that from their childhood they always wanted an older person. Older person but, shouldn't be twenty. No, the, the, what are you saying? They always because there are some women who are attached to the lifestyle of their parents. Mm. Yes, so I think that it really and truly really, there is no set rule. Mm. I don't think there's a set rule. Yeah, you said it to each his own. To each his own. So I think we should leave it at that. But this uh, woman and her uh, entitled uh, disposition. See this one. Yes. Well, it's it's, it's 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 something that I think women should think about. No matter how rich the guy might be, no matter how rich, even if one day you show up with a bunch of bananas, you show up with oranges, you show up. At least you let him know that um, you're not a freeloader. Women must put themselves in a position of respect, mm -hmm. or else they'll be treated like trash. Yeah, that's true. You, you know, so even if, it's, even, even if it's a, a bunch of bananas, a pineapple, something. Uh, I've heard people say, what do we want to give you? You have everything. No, mm. Nobody, yeah. even the richest of men. Still desire to be gifted something. Something. Um, you, have, you have something here. Okay, hello. Hello. Uncle Jimmy, good morning, morning sir. Morning. Yeah. And good morning to the guest. Good morning. Uh, you can nice my name. Mm -hmm. Yes. I want to talk about the age difference. I don't want to dwell on the fact that the guy did tell the mom and the daughter. Mm. I don't want to dwell on that fact. I just want to talk about the age difference. Yeah. I want to state clearly that um, uh, there's something that uh, ladies don't understand, and um, it works for men better. Men actually prefer, on the average, men actually prefer younger ladies. And mm. the fun aspect of it is that the older the men get, the younger the preference is for a lot of guys. Yes. Yes. So it's just what it is. It and um, there's with. nothing to it, actually. It serves, it serves a whole lot of reasons, which I wouldn't want to talk about. On okay. Radio. But that's it. Thank you. Okay, but hold on. Has he gone? Hold on. Oh, I wanted to ask him whether... Generally, of course, the exceptions to every rule, but generally, whether older men prefer younger women as wives. Hmm. It's enough if, if it's girlfriend, that is understood. That's a physical connection. But if emotionally for settling down oh, 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 older, I, I think it is, it's to his own. Um, like like I, I joked one time, <laughs> if I said this thing now, they say, oh, could be asked me again. Somebody asked me, and I said, I don't do nurseries. I do old people's home. But... <laughs> Again, as you grow older, you it depends. I think each situation comes with its own. I mean, because hey, I think you said it that there are some forty-year-old women that are jolly well even more mature than some women in their sixties. Indeed, some women who are older, as they get older, become children all over again. Hmm. I mean, so I think each each comes with its own uh, uh, merit, you know. So, what's your it's preference so, now, Uncle Jimmy? It's not for public consumption, and okay. I'm not. Are a, you now? I'm doing... not even. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not even available hmm. for anybody to come and say, I'm occupied. Oh. The door is sealed. Fantastic. Yes, yes, the door, the door is sealed. It's sealed. It's, what is the, what is the greatest gum that God ever created? The sealant. The gorilla seal. glue. <laughs> no, gorilla is stronger than that. Which one? Ah. The one they use for furniture, no, yellow fire. Ah, maybe we should call the people that can unseal it. Uh, no, and no, let's try no, yours. No, 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 no. <laughs> I'm, I'm occupied. Okay, now. I'm unavailable. Come on. They know they see you. 
<laughs> I'm on a village. <laughs> well, we know some people that they see you, Uncle Jimmy. They don't see me. Okay, now we'll, we'll, we'll see to that. I'm a new improved product. Oh, 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 <laughs> interesting. Elephant power. <laughs> new improved product. <laughs> oh, dear me. Yeah, yeah. So, let's see. Do we have any caller? Yeah, okay. Uncle Jimmy, there's, yes. There's on YouTube, uh, this person says that morning, Uncle Jimmy. Mm. I beg to disagree with your guest. I don't like the way Madame portrayed the man who pregnated his wife and girlfriend as jumping from one bed to the other. Two men is not too much. Two women is not too much. I didn't portray. He said he's philandering. That was his story. Uh, he said he's philandering. He was the one that said philandering. So, so we allow for two beds. Why should two beds? No, because okay, that's so it. if the guy can have two beds, the woman too can do two beds. Or hey, more. nobody has said that. Uh, everybody will face his own consequence. Mm -hmm. uh, so if, if people believe that what the man, why if people if people believe that what a man can do, a woman can do. I can't need your let now. Uncle uh, Jimmy, why should yes. you get married when you know that you are not ready to settle with one person? Why you can marry two now? Okay, why go into a one man, one bless, woman may relationship? God bless, may God bless, may God bless, may God bless my, my, my big uncle, Anikulapo. He married 27. And, I, 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 and his wife did not even leave. She was happy to welcome them. Uncle Kiwani. Jimmy. Good morning, Uncle Jimmy. Yes, good morning. <laughs> yeah, the name is, this is Moses calling from Lekki. Good morning, Moses, Carol. Good morning, Uncle Jimmy. Yes. And good morning to the one in the studio. There is no, you, you see, if a ma man settles down, yes, he's not supposed to cheat. God Even the you. other if denomination that believe you can marry two wives, he said Shubon, and it's a big lie. No one can treat a new car and a old car equally. Oh, fantastic, Moses. It's very impossible. The Quran simply says take one. Let's forget all this preacher that never follows what really the Quran or the Bible says. Mm. It means pick one. In Saudi, how many wives do they have? You, as a man, you need to have, or a woman, you need to have something called self control. These days, we preach, I think people want to eat their cake and, and have still it. have it in their hands. And, and keep that's it in what the fridge. The world promotes these days, which is very impossible. Okay. Thank you very Thank much. You. Thank you, Moses. Why are you thanking him? He's one running Moses program. is a wise guy. Well, he's wise now. I mean, if we had to go by that. We have another caller. It's so nice to hear new voices, you know. Very, yeah, refreshing. very refreshing. Very refreshing. Hello, good morning. Okay, it's gone. All right. Mm. Rolly. Okay. Rolly says that um Rolly says that I am sixteen and there's this nineteen year old who has been sending me text messages. Okay, sending me text messages informing me of how much he loves me. He keeps trying to convince me that I'm the only one who occupies his heart. Yeah. When I told him that I don't want him to be my boyfriend, he said he would always love me, even if I turned his heart out. Man. Oh. Ah! Right from cradle. Man. <laughs> he's a, he's a, he's a, he's a, I'm the only one who occupied his heart. Hey, yeah. <laughs> At 19. Hey, yeah. Hey, God Almighty. J.D. <laughs> like Bambo. Bambo, definitely, good morning. He's the one who calls me and he's a... Uh, his wife, Falake Ademli, now used to be Falake Lawansin. Falake Lawansin knew me when I was 19, when we were in Uniben. Uh, she can testify that I'm thinking like this. <laughs> Good morning to, to the two of you, Grandpa and Grandma. And when, uh, when I told him that I didn't want him to be my boyfriend, he said he would always love me, even if I told him. Two days later, he phoned and told me he really loves me. Uh -huh, he's moving in for the kill. I truly love this guy, but I'm not sure if he's trying to deceive me. Ah, uh, Rolly. How old is Rolly? Rolly, 16. Rolly 16. Face uh, your wife face and your jam wife. now. Face <laughs> your undergrad uh, studies. Wait, what age are you allowed to have a boyfriend? Uncle Jimmy. Advice parents. Okay, so as someone who has a daughter, mm. who I'm very close to, mm. I always say to her, you are free to have a boyfriend, but you are not free to go the whole way yes, with a boyfriend. Right. So a boyfriend is just a friend who is a boy. Which means that you can talk to this person, you can discuss, you won't see what is in his brain. Mm. So you can have someone like that, but it shouldn't go beyond that conversation and, you know. A 16 year old is um, just finishing SS3. Exactly. So, what's that business with having a boyfriend and turning his heart out? 
Mm. For now, I think she should focus on her studies and focus but, 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 but on but making is, good if, if friends. If a woman is already, if a girl mm -hmm. is already inclined at 16, at 16 she has a heart. Mm -hmm. Okay, back in their own time, even if they don't go the whole hog, mm -hmm. at 16 she'll be writing love letters mm -hmm, mm -hmm. in the garden of love where mm -hmm. birds are singing and whatever. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. She'll be perfuming it. Mm -hmm. She'll be putting it inside pink pink letterhead and pink envelope wow. and all this. There'll be love. She'll be reading meals and bones. Mm. She'll be doing all kinds. At 16, mm -hmm. her heart will be raising boom, 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 boom. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. So... How 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 do you advise parents to handle the sixteen year old at that age? You did oh you what you did you told your daughter, uh, but you said in the first instance you're very close to her. I'm very close to her. That's the yeah. first thing I will advise parents to be be their friend at that age. Their age. The, the the kind of friend that before they discuss with any other anything that comes to their mind before they share with any other person you are the first person they think about. Because when I think about when we were 16 from 5, I was going to A-levels. When we were in A-levels, I remember the first Valentine's Day we had in Compro when I was in lower 6. Do you know that none of us ever got married, but mentally we still pair people together. Exactly. And, and the bond is still there. It's still there. Um, some of them are the best of friends, you know, like the guys I did lower 6 with Dokundem and Aketi. God bless his soul and all of us. EB, everybody. Oh, oh, by the way, EB is not here, but I can quote what he said to me one day. He says, Young girls are my weakness. Uncle Jimmy, I love Kuba. Anyone that gives a secret with Uncle Jimmy is the no, he, did, he, was, he did say it was a secret. <laughs> but yeah, I sang it for him when we came to pay homage to our kitty here. Yeah. Young girls are my weakness. <laughs> Well, but I would really... I, I don't like advising a girl just go and read your book. No, no, no. It's a bit dismissive. It's, it is very, very dismissive. So I well, well, what are we going to tell Rolly now? That take it easy. Take it easy, Rolly. Your life Develop is a better relationship with... Sit back and watch. With your mom and you or a big sister or a big aunt that, is, that has her head in the right places as well because some auntie will even be the one to say, ah, it's okay to speak. I don't know if, if I can tell this to a 16-year-old. That a man never knows what, what he wants. What he truly feels about a woman until the deed is done. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's when the True. deed is done that his eyes become yeah, clear. Yeah. This True. one wants to pull his hat out. Yes. Say. He's been licking his lips and mm -hmm. so on and so forth. He wants to, he wants Once to he sleeps with you, Rolly, he will be able to say whether he wants to continue with you or he, want, he just wants you for sleeping but that, purpose. But that creates a dilemma. Supposing that happens, what does a woman do? You move on. Well... You learn from it, you learn from it yeah. and decide that do I want to keep sleeping with other guys to prove whether they love me or not? Or do I want to keep myself... Do you, know, do you know you can stretch a guy for four or five years and until the day he catches it? You see, some men enjoy the chase. Mm -hmm. And the moment they catch the it... The moment they catch it... The, the trail is gone. The, the trophy goes up and... Mm -hmm. uh, you know those things that they give you KLM? Mm -hmm. One time, those miniatures. Mm -hmm. Some men have a mental miniature tray in there you know, wherever they are, their homes or offices, and they imagine that... Uh, oh, this, this was is, what uh, it was like sleeping with Rolly. Yeah, this was what it was like sleeping with Funke. This was what Hawa was like. And, and no, so you know, Jimmy, There's no woman Bashir. Called Jimmy. There's no woman called Jimmy. Uh, no, no, some women too. You know, they just think, oh, this was how Bashir was like. This was how but Jimmy, Jimmy was like. But Jimmy, you are just calling me Uncle Jimmy. Now, how this come you are not for la Jimmy. If I had, did you notice? Before she was calling me, I could do it, I could do it, I could do it. Where did all relax? Say, Jimmy. No, no, no way. Pick a, pick a call. I could do it. Hello. Good morning, sir. Good morning. Good morning, EMC. Good morning. Yeah. See, this is just like where you are. This is like where you are. Good morning. I'm out. <laughs> I'm cool, sir. I'm Long cool, time, sir. okay, but you've kept the instructions yeah. to call once in a while. Good. <laughs> <laughs> See, I just want to say something mm. concerning 16 years old. Yeah. See, 16 years old is the new, is the new, what should I call it? New adult for ladies nowadays. I A guess lot so. Of guys. Yes. I guess it so. Is, mm. I'm over 30. I finished secondary school in 2009. 
And even in my secondary school days, I dated 16 years old. Imagine. Ah. Many years ago. Whoa, 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 whoa. See. No. It is I'm against the law. You are admitting to a crime. No, I'm not within. What Somebody should call me the attorney general or Mrs. <laughs> <laughs> what I'm saying is, see, 16 years old ladies, when you tell her, face your studies, do this, do this, you are like driving them away from you. They are going to go far. No, we didn't say face your studies. No, she didn't say face your studies. I said develop a closer relationship with your mom, and and the mom too should build a closer relationship with the daughter. So that you can talk one on one. Exactly. Okay, even after you build it, you still leave it in the hands of God and the hands of the lady. No matter what you do, if if a guy has, Mm. like, if a guy wants to really go at your your daughter, it's only God that can save you. Okay, Jesse, so, thank you very much. Thank you very much for your contribution. Highly appreciated. Uh, you will call again. I, I think I need to develop a timetable. So if uh, Chris called yesterday, when can he call again? He can call on Friday. By the way, yeah, Mrs. is there free, John? Are you cooking free, John? Match it by now. I'm traveling tomorrow. Yeah. Where will I eat free, John? Does anybody know who can... Uh, yesterday, someone sent a message that um, Grandma Lara will be cooking... Grandma Lara will be cooking. I should go to Ikorodu to go and cook for Fridjan. I mean, <laughs> they can send it to you. By boat. By yes. dispatch. No, you can send it by boat. Don't worry, I have Grandma Lara's I have a telephone number. Did she say specifically she'll be cooking Fridjan? Uh, she sent a message on WhatsApp. That she'll be she cooking. Uh, okay. So when she sent a message that she'll be cooking Fridjan, so therefore, so what does that mean now? Is it for us to know that she'll be cooking Fridjan or that she's going to send Fridjan to us? She has extended yeah. an open invitation, Uncle okay, Jimmy. Ah, that's no look problem. At, no. Yeah, look at the message. What, what does it say? Grandma there? Lara will be making free John. Good morning, JD and Feta. She sent it yesterday. Fantastic. Uh, well, I can get quiet. JD and Feta. She Uncle Jimmy, you are invited. invited. Let's go now. We can't go to Ecuador and come back the same day. It's foul. <laughs> and now, Grandma Lara will lodge us. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Well, could you? There's a question here that I really want you to answer as well. Yes. The person says, "Hello, Uncle JD. On mm. the issue of splitting bills, can men just make up their minds? On the one hand, they want a woman who have the virtues of our mothers who stayed at home, were submissive, and the men paid all the bills. And then when it doesn't suit them, they want to share bills and still expect the woman to do all the chores and still want to assign the so-called gender stereotype roles." Uh, my, my answer to that is very simple. The, the situation has, has made has uh, supplied us an answer. These days, if you have a partner, if you don't have a sharing attitude, that partner is going to go south. Even our mothers that they are talking about, yes, they brought something to the table as well. Yes, a lot of some, our mothers some, were seeming stressed that makes the clothes that the men and every member of their household wear. Yes, what, what we're saying is don't just be a freeloader, mm-hmm. you know, because uh, if you're a wrong person, we can understand that's. But if you want to be respected and so on and so forth, I mean, for God's sake, why should this be an argument? What is the name of that woman? Let me see. Tosin Yedele. Tosin Ah, yeah. How old is she? I don't know. You d- <laughs> maybe you want to... No, I, I want her to contact me for constant lecturing, monitoring and mentoring. No, you can start with the Amala date today. She knows she has, I'm not Google, you are not taking you. Yeah, she is. Someone this is take. a story. This is a story by a, this is by Yemisi. You can see it okay, by email. Now. Maybe it's you. I've never seen such a co- a control freak as my partner. We live together and he seems to have his own way of doing things. Whenever I'm in the kitchen, he's always hovering around telling me how to get better results. Yet he refuses to cook. He lectures me on how to drive and argues all the time about my friends behavior and mode of dressing. I love him a lot, though, but his constant moans are wearing me down. How do I cope with this unusual problem? I can't stay with somebody who, with a nag. In this case, we call it a nag. I can't handle it. No, 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 I don't no. have that temperament. Someone so controlling already shows you the kind of mindset he has. I can't so handle what it. what are you I doing can't with him? If you can't handle this guy, what's his name? Yemisi. Yemisi, if, if you can't I handle, think it's better for you to let him Just go. take a walk. Mm. Yes, I can't, I can't handle it. Yemisi is 525, you gotta go. Ah, it was nice having you. 525, you know. Uncle Jimmy, or 9? 925, sorry. 955. 955, you gotta go. We gotta go. Thank you very much, Yemisi, for coming. Thank you so much, Uncle Jimmy. Well, well your first I've time watching my programs. Time. Hmm? Next week, you are going to participate with the female listener, okay? All right, good. Sit down, please. Thank you. That's why we're going to end the feta. Thank you very much. What's up, Lagos comes up next. Tomorrow, I'm going to have Pastor Wale Adifarasin. Wow. Pastor Wale 
at that pharmacy. And uh, it, it, we're going to be talking about doing it right. And don't forget, I said next week, I'm going to have Auntie, what's the lady's name now? This um, woman that has this thing against past, oh, some pastors. Yeah, that has a beef with the pastors. She's going to be here next week, Friday. So spread the word. And please note that the story is about her and not about pastors. People who are saying that... And she's not even saying pastors. She, she said Nigerian, Nigerian pastors. Nigerian pastors are not all. She yeah. said some. Some Nigerian some pastors. Some Nigerian pastors. So, so people should not fret. Exactly. Already, you started accusing me. You should put it in a balance. Mm. You should. She hasn't even spoken. with exactly. balance. Exactly. And like I said... Some Nigerian I'm pastors. I'm interested in her perspective of what she thinks. So don't think I'm going to be lining up 54 pastors, talking to them one by one. Besides, I'm a dog in our fight anyway. So it's all for a better Nigeria. Thank you very much, MC. Thank you very much, everybody. See you tomorrow. Ah, what's up next? What's up next? Let's read again. What's up, Lagos? Uh, let's let's read. Let's try. I will try oh, this yeah. time. One, two, no, go. Let's do one, two. Wait, wait. Who counts? I'll count. You count. Yes. Wait. One, why don't I count? Oh, yeah, you count. No, I think you ladies first. You okay. should count. One, two, one, two go. three. What's up, Lagos? How did you do this? <laughs> News talk every day. Can the woman make you steal? Oh yes, a woman can make you do it. Ninety-nine point three Nigeria Info. We are more than just radio. Subscribe to our YouTube channel at Nigeria Info FM. Check us out on Facebook at Nigeria Info ninety-nine point three. Follow us on Twitter at Nigeria Info FM and on Instagram at Nigeria Info FM Lagos for live updates as it happens. Ninety-nine point three Nigeria Info. Let's talk. 99.3 Nigeria Info. We are more than just radio. Subscribe to our YouTube channel at Nigeria Info FM. Check us out on Facebook at Nigeria Info 99.3. Follow us.